Hello there folks, my name is Alexander Moroz and today is the date when I will officially release the first Moroz Video Converter benchmark beta version for public and uh, Moroz Video Converter benchmark is based on Moroz Video Converter software but Moroz Video Converter benchmark is a freeware and will be available for everyone to download for free Moros Video Converter Benchmark is dedicated to overclockers, to PC enthusiasts and people who's looking to improve their hardware, PC hardware uh, performance. On the screen right here we see the Moros Video Converter Benchmark beta version. Only this one is a uh, developer version and uh, you can see the uh, black square is not on the full screen like it should be and just because I'm trying to um, working on something currently uh, to improve this version but on your version it will be the black screen will be all the way to the right and uh, you can see it has the run button and it has the loading bar if you will go ahead and uh, click run it will run the benchmark Benchmark is utilizing all the cores and uh, let's have a look. By the way, today I'm running i7-930 uh, overclock on Intel uh, stock cooler to from 2.8 gigahertz to 3.6 gigahertz and this computer is um, for my body and uh, for my friend, one of my friends and uh, Basically, I'm testing uh, the performance 2.8, 3.6, 4.0 gigahertz, and I'm going to compare it to my new, as you already knew, if if you're a subscriber, to my new i7-2600K, heavily overclocked to 4.8 gigahertz or 5. Well, we'll see how it will go. I didn't build that system yet because this is my old system, and it's going away. And I would like to get all the benchmark from it, and I'm currently benching it with my software so you can see I'm very dedicated to overclocking and PC enthusiast that's why this software is for free and I'm encourage you to try it if you're a PC enthusiast or overclocker let's go ahead and get our scores together guys and I'm planning in the future to improve the software I'm planning in the future to build a website where I'm going to collect the scores from you guys and you can share the scores like 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 that system 3d mark but it's going to be like a CPU benchmark for video converting as you can see it's utilizing all the Intel technologies which utilizing all the four cores and utilizing also the hyper trading or multi trading technology so it's using all the eight threads pretty neat huh it will also use the 12 cores as well or 12 threads so um, as you can see benchmark is going and um, I already tested my MacBook 2010 white which is 2.4 uh, gigahertz and the score was 17 minutes with 8 gigabyte of RAM and um, let's see how the i7-930 at 3.6 um, uh, will score and I will also test it at 4 gigahertz with a nice uh, hitting on it and it's stock and then I will uh, test it against my i7 2600k the new processor let's go ahead and uh, download this version over this link over here go to visit this link and download this software uh, that th this comes from me and I'm the lead developer so you can trust me guys I I gave you my word on it and it's from mrzmedia.com website it's my developer website where I uh, with the team we develop some softwares and we're selling currently the software uh, not one but two, but two and this one is going to be there but as a freeware and I'm looking forward to make this software very popular we will see how it will go help me out as a subscribers, especially if you're a subscriber, help me out with that. Let's go ahead and share our scores, guys, in the comments below. And this software works with Windows XP 32-bit, 64-bit, with Windows 7 32-bit, 64-bit, any edition. Today I'm using Windows 7 64-bit, ultimate version. 
and if during uh, go ahead and install it it has the professional setup with an install option there is no trojans no uh, viruses no uh, spywares I give you uh, give you my word on it okay so I guarantee you this if you will go ahead and download from this link below from my site okay I'm looking forward to put this software everywhere. I'm looking forward to share with the hardware and uh, overclocker communities. If you are on, in one or already joined in one community already and you know you can go ahead and post this software on their forums and share it. You're welcome to. I give you that permission. Let's go ahead and post this course. Wow, i7 look like it's cracking. Let's see how it will what the result will be so software converting 1920 by 1080 video 30p into the 1280 by 720 and uh, reducing its size about by six times uh, still a great quality of the final result and uh, it, it give you the result the statistic result back so you can share with your friends and hopefully in the future in the newer versions I will make it online so you can share it online and then post it on Facebook's and stuff like so so you can see conversion of WMV so it was converting into WMV so it can play on any Windows computer it took 5 minutes 6 seconds and 23 milliseconds whatever Okay, so you got my score, and uh, this is the i7. Um, i7 um, 930 overclock at 3.6 from 2.8. Four cores plus hyper threading, which eight um, threads. Okay, software is done, and uh, you can see it's getting. done with the course here we go here's my time show me your time guys so as again I'm very glad to introduce you the morose video converter benchmark and I will make sure the software will be in any um, software uh, file sharing systems out there and it will be freeware for you to try and hopefully overclockers and PC enthusiast communities will love it all right Thank you so much. Download it over the link in the over here in the left top corner. And also check the details of the video description. I will put the link down below as well. If you will install the software and uh, when you will click run, you will see the black screen. Go ahead and run the executable file as administrator and it will be just fine. Okay? Also, software requires the XVID, uh, XVID um, codec, and if you don't have that codec, you can Google for it. It's free, or I included in the uh, in the setup for you the FFD show, so you can. It's a free libraries of the codecs, so you can install it and use it. It's very neat as well, and you don't need to download anything. So go ahead and try that. Let me know what you think. And yeah, looking forward to your comments. Peace.